if you want to know the best detective movies, you should definitely watch our picks for the best ones of the 2000s. Where is she? Where the fuck is Harmony? Harry. You want to play hardball? I can do that. Where is the girl? We hope you will enjoy the following ranking. Please let us know your favorite in the comments and make sure to subscribe to never miss a good movie again. Number 10. We know where the ring is. It's in the stripper's vagina. Not anymore. Mystery Team is a comedy film directed by Dan Ekman and stars Donald Glover, DC Pearson, Dominic Deerkers, and Aubrey Plaza. Reminding the audiences of classics like The Goonies or The Three Investigators, Mystery Team is the family adventure of three lifelong friends, Jason, Duncan, and Charlie, who have been solving neighborhood mysteries for eternity. Now all eyes are on them as a local woman hires them to find her father's killer. But a real-life crime may be a challenge too far. When she was peeing, I heard a clink. Oh no. Are you sure? Yes. Number 9. The Luger found there, on the floor, heavily oiled, no prints. He kept it in the nightstand. Hollywood Land is a neo-noir period mystery film directed by Alan Coulter and stars Adrian Brody, Diane Lane, and Ben Affleck. Using the detective genre to form an intriguing plot around the rise and fall of a Hollywood superstar, Hollywood Land follows Detective Simo who faces links to his personal life with a case involving the murder of Superman star actor George Reeves. But what seems to be the answer is just the tip of the iceberg of a massive conspiracy. It's a suicide shot to the temple. Where's the burn? When a gun is discharged directly yeah, against... Yeah, the coroner never checked. He didn't notice the bruises on the body either. Which, by the way, aren't automatic, okay? Certain conditions have to be present. Number 8. It's an inside job. I bet my life on it. You bet your life on the Giants, too, and they're in sixth place. Hey, listen, can we talk without the warden being here? The Curse of the Jade Scorpion is a crime comedy film written and directed by Woody Allen and stars him alongside Dan Aykroyd, Helen Hunt, Wallace Shawn, and Charlize Theron. Led by its charming director and main protagonist, The Curse of the Jade Scorpion is the absurd story of top insurance investigator C.W. Briggs in 1940s New York. Swearing to his worth before his firm's efficiency expert, he is surprised to be caught up in the game of a thief whose mind is getting into Briggs's brain. What makes you so positive it's an inside job? Because it couldn't be that smooth unless it was inside. Miss Fitzgerald is suggesting, given the magnitude of the loss, that we expand our investigation. Number 7. Well, this has been real educational, but I don't believe in the devil. He should. He believes in you. Constantine is a 2005 occult detective film directed by Francis Lawrence and stars Keanu Reeves, Rachel Weisz, Shia LaBeouf, and Tilda Swinton. It is the story of an ordinary man with an extraordinary gift. Now he has no choice but to save the planet from the purest evil. Being able to see spirits, both good and bad, that walk among us unnoticed, Constantine is given the responsibility to act as a guardian in the middle ground between them. Oh, so it's fun. It's fun when a man beats his wife to death. It's fun when a mother drowns her own baby. And you think the devil is responsible. People are evil, Mr. Constantine. People. Number six. Hey. What are you doing here? Just listening. Brick is a neo-noir mystery film written and directed by Ryan Johnson and stars Joseph Gordon-Levitt. Nora Zahentner, Noah Fleiss, and Megan Good. This ultimately fresh and innovative throwback to classic noir detective movies will surprise you with an unlikely setting, a high school. After receiving a mysterious call from his ex, loner Brandon is told her dead body was found. Convinced to solve the riddle on his own, he infiltrates school cliques that he normally avoided, accidentally leading him to trouble with a drug kingpin. Number five. I threw it in the lake because I figured you wouldn't, I would. I got priors in New York, so I really can't, I can't be messing around. You with threw it away. Yeah, plus it's evidence. You what? Watch it. Kiss Kiss Bang Bang is a black comedy crime film written and directed by Shane Black and stars Robert Downey Jr., Val Kilmer, Michelle Monaghan, and Corbin Burnson. 
Made possible by Shane Black's smart creation, Kiss Kiss Bang Bang is a nostalgic throwback to classic detective stories with a big heart and lots of great twists and turns. Accidentally stumbling into a Hollywood audition after robbing a store, scumbag Harry is introduced into the world of fame, but through another coincidence tumbles right into a horrifying conspiracy. What happens when they drag the lake? You think they'll find my pistol? Jesus. Look up idiot in the dictionary. You know what you'll find? A picture of me? No. The definition of the word idiot, which you fucking are. Number four. First, distract target. Then block his blind jab. <laughs> Counter with cross to left cheek. Sherlock Holmes is a 2009 period mystery action film directed by Guy Ritchie and stars Robert Downey Jr., Jude Law, Rachel McAdams, and Mark Strong. Fast, stylized, and packed with creative action scenes, the charming but cynical Sherlock Holmes and his companion, Dr. Watson, investigate a case that couldn't be more mysterious. The perfect challenge for the infamous mastermind. But soon, both understand the real obstacles and upcoming challenges that will put their friendship in everlasting danger. As your doctor, he'll be stretched as a tribute in no time. As your friend! You've been in this room for two weeks. I insist you have to get out. There's nothing of interest for me out there on Earth at all. Number three. 평소처럼 장전해서 잡을래요? 정말 끝까지 말안할 건가요? Joint Security Area is a South Korean mystery thriller film directed by Park Chan Wook and stars Lee Young A, Lee Byung Hun, and Song Kang Ho. This is not only about truth, but about determining a winner. With the conflict between North and South Korea at its peak, a neutral investigator is needed when a murder is committed right between the borders. As both sides swear to their innocence, the truth becomes a blurred memory covered by fog, seemingly impossible to clear. Number 2 Spela spel, surfa på nätet. Ja, oh, surfar du mycket på nätet? Millennium Series is a 2009 Swedish crime thriller film series directed by Niels Arden Oplev and stars Michael Nyquist and Numi Rapace. This masterwork trilogy adapting the dark, twisted book series discovers human abysses through the eyes of two protagonists who couldn't be more different. When a once famous journalist and a mentally sick hacker team up to revisit an old case of potential murder, what they find goes way further than anyone wanted, showing the sheer power of systematic crime. You did well, huh? Slow me down. If it becomes the least problem with you, Lisbeth, so I'll see that you become inspired the rest of life. Do you understand me? I know everything about your psychic problems and your bizarre background. Before we unveil movie number one, here are a few honorable mentions. We're missing three. And the sergeant. It's not West. Ah, oh, tell me it wasn't West. You know Sergeant West, sir? He was our black hat. That must have been quite an honor, sir. I'm guessing you two are working with Lawrence McNabb, the locksmith, that he gives you the keys and you're responsible for the recent string of burglaries. However, you should know the DA is only interested in McNabb. You two could make a deal with him and that Charlie, the security guard, is about to walk through that door. You okay? Yeah, you okay? Yeah. Let's go see if we can find Lockridge at work. What do you mean, let's go? We just shot up half the valley. Now, did you hit anyone? No, thank God. Well, neither did I. Let's go. Number one. Some other motherfuckers let full rub on them. I don't play squeamish, but I don't fuck with no kids. Have you ever been caught in a situation between morality and legality? Well, Gone Baby Gone is all about one particularly acrimonious scenario. A little girl is kidnapped, and a pair of detectives from Boston, Patrick and Angie, investigate and try to solve the case. Ben Affleck, known for his short movies, wrote and directed his first full-length neo-noir mystery thriller film in 2007. The performances by Casey Affleck, Michelle Monaghan, and Morgan Freeman make it a must-watch. And if that girl only hope is you, will I pray for her? Because she's gone, baby. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments.
If you want to know more about a particular movie in this list, you can check out our links in the video description. And for more top 10 movie videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.